pandas where. So what you're going to be doing here is you're going to be replacing values in your data frame or your series. And you're going to do that via pandas where. However, the really important part to understand is that values will only get replaced if a condition is false. So let's take a look at what this looks like. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to import pandas as PD. And I'm also going to import NumPy as MP because we're going to use some random numbers. So first thing that I'm going to do is create my data frame that we're going to be working with. And I'm going to do that by, um, first of all, setting the NumPy random seed, meaning you'll be able to get the same exact random numbers as I do. I'm going to create my data frame and I'm going to create it with random numbers between zero and 100. And these are going to be different test scores for four different students. I'll run this and you can see that we have Bob, Sally, Frank, and Patty for each one of their tests. Now, say I wanted to um, replace all these scores above 90. Say I wanted to replace that with maybe an A plus or an A plus string. Well, in order to do that, I first need to find the scores that are under 90 because the scores that are under 90 will evaluate true and the scores that are above 90 will evaluate false. And remember that pandas where will only replace the values that evaluate to false. So I'll do this right here. And this is just to show you what it looks like. And I have two scores that evaluate to false. Looks like Bob test two and Patty test, test three. Yep, this one is above 90 and so is this one. Okay, cool. So in order to replace these with pandas where, what I'm first gonna do is call data frame dot where I'm going to pass in this conditional, which I'm using a data frame conditional here, and I'm going to replace with A+. plus. So these falses will get replaced with A+. plus. Run this. Yep. And as you can see, we get an A plus replace here and an A plus replace here. Now, instead of a data frame, you can also do a series conditional. So if I were to see only where test three is below 90, and replace all those scores that evaluate false so that they're above 90. So it looks like there's only one right here, which is Patty equals false. Now, if I apply this to my whole data frame, you'll see that the entire row gets replaced with A plus. So here, because this value right here was above 90, pandas went and replaced the entire row with A plus because I'm calling it purely just on a series and I'm passing a series of trues and falses instead of a data frame of trues and falses, okay? Next thing that we're gonna do is you can also do a, con uh, a callable condition. So a callable is gonna be like a function. And here I'm calling a lambda function. So what pandas is gonna do is it's gonna look at every single value within your data frame. And in this case, it's gonna say X and then is X um, below 75? If it is, give it a true. If it's not, give it a false. And remember, falses will get replaced. So I'll go ahead and run this. And as you can see, we have a lot more scores that were above 75, and these all get replaced with A pluses, okay? Now, the next thing you can do is you can also set a callable within your uh, other value. So we haven't called it explicitly here, but this second parameter that we're passing is called other. And so I'm saying here, hey, where the data frame values are below 90, then you'll get a true. So the above 90 ones will get replaced. And what I want you to replace it with is the square of the value that's there in the first place. I'll go ahead and run this. And you can see here, remember from our first one that Bob test two got replaced and so did Patty test three. And well, what I replaced them with is the square of their score beforehand. Now that doesn't make a ton of sense with the scores, but say you had something else where you know, you wanted to apply some arithmetic on top of what you wanted to replace. Well, you can use a Lambda function for that. And then the last thing that we're going to do is replace with a, uh, another data frame. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create another data frame and this is a second set of scores. So now I have new scores for Bob, Sally, Frank, and Patty. And what I want to do is I want to replace my first data frame with values from the second data frame if a condition is false. So we go back to our scores below 90, that's gonna evaluate true to all the scores above 90, but then we're gonna see that these Bob test two and these Patty test three, those are gonna get replaced with values from our second data frame. I'll run this, and you can see here that these are all the same scores from our first data frame. However, this 35 replaced what was there beforehand because it's the 35 from our second data frame. Same thing with this three replaced it from the second data frame three on there. 
So that is how you kind of selectively replace uh, values from one data frame with values from another data frame. And that is pandas.where.